Hello, everyone. We're here on the post-game show as WT provides another shellacking to another Lone Star Conference opponent. 88-60, the final score as WT defeats Texas A&M Kingsville. James Haddon with Angelo Pontello. And as we think about this game as a whole, WT in the first half hit nine threes, did a very good job shooting the basketball, also forced A&M Kingsville to shoot just 30% from the field, 7 for 23 from inside the arc and then think about from long range hitting those five threes but those were five of just seven made buckets for the javelinas in that first half and so as we kind of look back on the game as a whole cj jennings in the first half was absolutely impeccable 15 first half points one off a career high did not score in the second half but really was the catalyst for wt's just premonition throughout that first half and in the entire game C.J. Jennings really stepped the or set the tone for WT and how they were going to be able to ultimately come up with this big win over Kingsville. But just like we mentioned in the broadcast, James, C.J. Jennings got the ball rolling. Then we didn't see as much of him in the second half because you had Gotch, Gotch, David Chablovic, and Drew Evans all step up and get into double digits tonight. So lots of basketball to be played, but uh, another good showing shooting the basketball for West Texas today. With Angelo Pontello, I am James Hadnot. Want to say thank you for tuning into this broadcast of West Texas A&M basketball on WTSN.